What's up, guys? We're going to talk a little bit about uh, the market cycles, right? And altcoins versus Bitcoin and the similar things that happen. And a lot of you guys are newer to the market. So you don't really like you start to see things and you're it kind of makes you question things because you haven't experienced it before. And what I'm referring to is like Bitcoin maxis, for example, right? Every cycle you get Bitcoin maxis and they start bashing altcoins and they say Bitcoin is the one and the only one and all the alts are going to zero and you know this project's crap, that project's crap, S coin this, S coin that. That's what maxis do, right? And as we go along, you'll notice, like if you've been around for a while, you'll notice that it's the same every cycle and they're wrong every single time, right? So the reason I'm talking about it is because, you know, like some of you guys get scared, you're newer and you hear this stuff, you read it, whatever, and you're like, oh my God, is this true? And that's perfectly understandable, right? But what you have to understand is that, again, this is perfectly normal for the market cycle. And, uh, you know, it's almost like the Bitcoin maxis at this point in time are like a you know, like a, like a signal, like a, you know, to let you know that we're on course. Right. Um, because like, uh, for example, we were watching Michael Saylor this morning on the, on the live stream and, you know, he was talking about, you know, Bitcoin being, you know, as great as it is. And I agree with him on Bitcoin. I agree with what he says. Um, and I agree that Bitcoin will be a million dollars. Uh, I agree with his uh, DCA strategy, regardless of whatever the price is, your dollar cost average in. I agree with all that stuff that he has to say. However, that's where the buck stops because he ends up with his Bitcoin maxi ignorance. And he started talking about how, uh, and I shit you not, he says Ethereum, uh, Cardano, and he says Ripple XRP, will all be labeled as securities and only Bitcoin will will be available, will be good. Everything else will be destroyed, according to him. Everything else will be a security. He said, specifically, Ethereum, Cardano, and XRP will be labeled securities. Uh, and that's where you got to be careful because Michael Saylor clearly does not pay attention to what's going on in the digital asset space as a Bitcoin maxi, which most Bitcoin maxis do not pay attention to what's going on in space because XRP is already legally declared not a security. They won the case against the SEC and the point of XRP not being a security is not appealable, which means it cannot be appealed. It cannot be reversed. That decision is precedent. So that tells you Michael Saylor does not know his ass from his elbows when it comes to anything outside of Bitcoin, right? So that's why you can't listen to these types of individuals, guys, right? Have conviction in your projects, do your research and uh, hold strong, right? Don't get shaken out because that's what they want, man. Right? Michael Saylor wants you to sell all your altcoins and get only into Bitcoin because he holds Bitcoin, right? So, of course, he's going to say stuff like that. He wants all the retail people sell all your alts and put all that liquidity into Bitcoin to jack up the price of Bitcoin because he holds Bitcoin, right? So, in saying that, guys, be able to identify these kinds of scam schemes and ignorant people who don't know what they're talking about, and you'll be better off for it. So... Let me know what you guys think. Hit the like, hit the subscribe button, guys. Click the join button to become a member of the channel. And, uh, you know, you get micro cap uh, gem uh, live streams on Sundays. Uh, you don't want to miss out on those guys. Uh, we have over 300 people in the community there to help you with your exit strategies, your profit taking, uh, help you figure out what's going on in uh, in the market because it can it can be very, very complicated for new people. And that's why we're here, because of the confusion that gets caused by people like Michael Saylor, for example. Uh, so definitely check that out, guys. Click the join button for that. Uh, it's incredibly cheap. It's four bucks, guys. Like, And you get all the help that you need. Uh, portfolio structure, exit strategies, profit taking, all that stuff and more. Or join the Patreon for all that, plus Patreon-only content. My portfolio is over there. You get to check that out. What I hold, why I hold it, how, where I think it's going, and how much of it I hold. Uh, you get to see all that, my portfolio breakdown, and uh, so much more. So yeah, and follow me on X, guys. So hit the like, hit the subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.